What is going on everyone? The Houston Texans have already started their free agency. The sense of urgency is there and shout out to Landry Locker for getting this right. I have the tweet here for Ian Rappaport. Former Titans and Rams wide receiver Robert Woods is signing with the Texans, adding a veteran presence to a young team. He gets a two-year $15.25 million deal with $10 million fully guaranteed and a max value of $17 million. A new quarterback's best friend. That veteran presence that Ian Rappaport talked about, yes, it is here. I am excited for Robert Woods. Welcome, everyone, to the 713 Houston Sportcast. I am your host, Ruben Calavillo. I drop daily Houston Texans content over here. We are 47 days away from the NFL Draft. Free agency starts this Thursday, ladies and gentlemen. It is an exciting time to be a Houston Texans fan, so make sure you guys are tapped in. How do I feel about Robert Woods? Well, I'm kind of on the fence, but I'm more leaning to liking this signing because, like Ian Rappaport put in the tweet, the veteran presence there, you are shipping away Brandon Cooks, right? And the whole Brandon Cooks fiasco, I'm just so happy, you know, just to wipe my hands clean with it. I am sick of Brandon Cooks. Signing extension in the offseason was so upset the way the season was going, was liking pictures of him in other uniforms when we didn't trade him at the deadline. Well, he wanted to be a crybaby and not play against the Philadelphia Eagles. Good riddance, Brandon Cooks. I want a wide receiver who has a ring on his finger, and that is Robert Woods. And that is kind of where, you know, it gets for me. Because when you look at the production of Robert Woods, it just wasn't there. His first season in Tennessee, 53 catches, 527 yards, which is a career low, by the way, and two tutties. You know, you have to also put into consideration he dealt with three different quarterbacks, Ryan Tannehill, Joshua Dobbs, Malik Willis. The whole Tennessee Titans offense as a whole was just, you know, a you know, a disappointment. Nonetheless, he played a full 17 game, started 15 of them, coming off an ACL injury in 2021. That's a key point that I like there, right? Plays a full season after having a huge knee injury. He is 31 years old. When you look at his production with the LA Rams, this is where it excites you about the possibility of Robert Woods on this Houston Texans team. In 2020, he had 936 yards. In 2019, 1,102 tutties. In 2018, 1,206 tutties. The production is there for Robert Woods. He was putting up numbers with Jared Goff. He was putting up numbers with Matthew Stafford. And when you are the Houston Texans, you want him to put up numbers who whoever the hell you are going to take at two. It looks like right now that will be Bryce Young because CJ Stroud has opened up as the favorite to be selected number one overall. But when you look at this signing and at a time where it came, well, it screams sense of urgency. And this is something that I said the Houston Texans have lacked for many years. And I don't think they just did it off a of coincidence. Once again, I think they made a statement just like they did when they were announcing the OC and DC hires there in Super Bowl Sunday. Everyone was talking about the Houston Texans there in the morning. Nonetheless, I think it shows that we are trying to get better because Robert Woods should not stop you from signing more wide receivers. It shouldn't stop you from drafting a wide receiver in the top three rounds. At the end of the day, I see Robert Woods being a number two, maybe a number three wide receiver here for the Houston Texans. But being a reliable security blanket, if he puts up a 600-yard season with the Houston Texans, well, I am excited for that. He also was a leading leader for Tennessee, right? Just to throw that in there. But Robert Wood should not be your wide receiver when going into this offseason, like I said. And what it excites me for is because he is a good route runner, right? One of the best route runners in the league, for sure, hands. What are you going to get from Robert Woods? That is the question here. And if he goes out there and puts up an 800-plus yard season, well, this was a home run get for the Houston Texans. But nonetheless, they started their free agency off with wide receiver Robert Woods. How do you guys feel about this? I'm kind of excited. Let me know. As always, go Texans. You guys have a very blessed day.